Hello, everybody. How are you? <laughs> Welcome back to my channel. I'm so happy. It's Friday. Oh my God. The reason why I'm so happy is I am going to Hawaii, Honolulu this Sunday, and、um, stay there until next Wednesday. Last time I was there is literally four years ago, I think. Yeah, four or five years ago. So I can't wait. To go back there to visit my friends over there, and if you're living in Honolulu area, definitely message me so we can meet up, have coffee. Today's videos we're gonna talk about why are we exfoliating our skin, and what is exfoliate, how to exfoliate, and what are the watch out for exfoliations. Yeah, let's get started. This is a really interesting con conversation, right? Before I start my today's videos,、um, if this is the first time you watch my video, hello. I'm Steve. A little、uh, background about me: I've been in cosmetics for over twenty-six years, and I work at a lot of major different cosmetic company.、Um, I've been a beauty consultant before, makeup artist, business manager, national makeup artist team, and I, I've done it all pretty much. And I help over thousands of people in my past some twenty years experience. And the last. Sixteen years, I was working at this major skincare brand called SK Two. Not sure if you heard about that brand. It's one of the prestigious skincare from Asia, and then I was with them for for very long time. Last nine ten years, I was the country trainer for the brand.、Um, so I have a lot of knowledge in beauty, and that's why my channel is all about. We are focused on beauty, skincare, and makeup. A little bit makeup, more beauty product. Instead, just review beauty product. I do a lot of educational content for you guys. So I hope you like what you hear. If you like it, you know what to do. Subscribe my YouTube channel and turn on the notification bell so you know the time I release a video. And I do video every day. All right, let's get to today's topic. Okay, so for this exfoliate content, we're gonna focus on four areas. Number one, why we exfoliate. Number two, how we exfoliate. Number three, what are the results you're gonna see. And number four, to what are the things you need to watch out. Okay, number one, why we exfoliate. Our body will naturally remove the surface dead skin every single day. In fact, our entire lifetime. Your skin will polish off dead skin over five to six, seven pounds. That's crazy. Do you know how much dead skin that is, right? But you don't see it because they are so tiny. You can't really see with your eyes. But the problem is that as we age, due to hormonal, emotional, environmental, medication, all the thing in life, cause your skin no longer function properly. Yeah, if you're over forty years old, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Then your skin have a lot of built up dead skin. Then you're gonna experience your makeup stuck in the pores, or you're gonna feel like the makeup doesn't last at all. Just gonna sit on top of the skin, or you feel you doesn't matter what you use, your skin's constantly feel dry. Or even worse, you can see some dry patches on the skin or peeling on the skin. So these are the sign that your body tell you you need to polish off the skin. ASAP. So how to exfoliate? There are so many different products on cosmetic that will help you to exfoliate. So we want to talk about the skincare first and a tool later. Okay. So the skincare you can using for I don't have everything here with me right now, but to give you some example, the mo most simple thing that you can do is toner. You can find any toner that contain either AHA is alpha hydroxy acid. Or gli、um, or beta hydroxy acid, anything that will help you polish off surface dead skin. You just need to use cotton pad and polish off the dead skin. Very simple. And if you're too lazy to using cotton pad and your toner, now there's day they call this a facial radiant pads. Like this is by First Aid Beauty. Basically, it is a toner already infused in the cotton pad, and all you need to do just polish off the dead skin. But let me tell you, this costs more money, so you might as well just get the cotton pad and do this yourself. Same thing. So that's one. The other things you can buy, you can buy the exfoliate beads. You know, little scrub, right? So scrub, there's two types of scrub that you can purchase. There's one is a natural scrub beads in there, and the other one is man-made. The difference is a natural one has a more sharper edge, and 
I definitely don't recommend that too much. That's the apricot scrub that you saw in the drugstore. They are more natural scrub. But again, if you have a sensitive skin, the the actual scrub can be harsh and can cut your skin a little bit and cause more sensitivity. So I definitely recommend you find this more refined uh, scrub. They are, it's perfectly round and it's more gentle to polish your skin so you can exfoliate, polish off your dead skin. And I, this is how I recommend you use this. If you have oily skin, you can do it like twice a week. Um, if you have a dry skin, I will probably recommend you use once a week. If you have a sensitive skin, this is what I recommend you. You can still do it once a week, but instead of using the scrub directly to the face, you want to mix your scrub with any moisturizer you have at home and gently massage just like three times. Let it sit for 30 seconds and rinse it off. So you because the moisturizer adding as a buffer. So the scrub is not touch your skin too strong and cause more irritations so you can do that there are so many skin tools out there like new face uh, uh, it is a uh, microcurrent technology so basically it's stimulating the skin muscle beneath and have your skin renew the skin naturally and there's a red light there's a blue light all this different led light out there it's more like a light therapy technology so they're stimulating the skin again so your skin can be recharge and they do what it's supposed to do that's the technology part but all those two are definitely more expensive you're looking at starting hundred dollar up to five hundred dollars and there's number three i want to mention to you are the mask any type of clay mask uh, also has ability to polish our surface of dead skin but they are much more gentle because most of clay masks they are really more like a deep cleansing Deep cleanse your pores, but because they do that, they also polish a little bit on the skin. Say that if you absolutely have no money to buy anything like that, this thing called towel. <laughs> you can actually wet your towel with warm water and place a towel on the face. Gently circulation. That is free. You don't need to pay. You can do that once a week or once a month depends your skin conditions and as you polish off that will literally polish out the surface that skin too but that you need to be a little bit more careful if you don't know what you're doing you can cause a lot of redness on the skin so i pretty much cover everything how you can exfoliate your skin so what are the results after you exfoliate your skin right it doesn't matter you are using skincare or skincare tool or manually using the cloth washcloth to wash your face right you should see your skin is more brighter the texture of your skin is going to be a little bit more smoother and overall you're going to notice that your skincare absorb quicker your makeup is going to look better on the surface of the skin too so those are the result however if you don't exfoliate regularly, your skin is going to naturally build up more dead skin layer. So that's why you should really um, you should really exfoliate once a week or once a month or twice a month based on your skin conditions. And then you need to make sure you put enough moisturizer on the skin so you not polish out too much dead skin and cause dehydration for your skin. Does that make sense? There's, there's a lot of back and forth, right? So let's talk about watch out, you know. What is that you need to be aware when you exfoliate your skin? You definitely, you definitely don't want to over exfoliate your skin. That could be very dangerous. So what do I mean by over exfoliate your skin? So for example, remember the toner? Say that if you have a toner, have an alpha hydroxy acid in there. So you already exfoliate it once. And then you are using the retinol A, it's vitamin A serum. Retinol A is also exfoliate the skin. You do that. And then you use a vitamin C moisturizer. Believe it or not, that also exfoliate your skin. So you exfoliate three times. Don't do that. What's happening is that if you over exfoliate your skin and if you have a dry and sensitive skin, your skin is going to become very irritated. And you, you can feel the tingling sensation. You're going to feel burning, even if you sting a little bit. So that means you polish it way too much. Or if you're using the washcloth, don't like you're not polishing your shoes or car okay this is your face i seen people polish your face like they are waxing the car this is very delicate 
this face is gonna stay with you for very, very long time. So the best way to do it, let me kind of show you. Say that this is the cloth, right? You really just want a very gentle circulate motion, very slow. And you want to make sure your face is wet, your cloth is wet, and very, very gently, just one time. Like this. That's it, and then maybe we're gonna neck area. Don't do this. Uh, you know, like very rough. You're gonna polish out too much and make your skin more sensitive. And that is definitely what you don't want to do. So, what do you think so far? Did you learn something about exfoliating your skin? Leave a comment below and let me know how often you exfoliate. What are you using to exfoliate your skin? I'd love to hear that from you guys. And one more thing, I do want to tell you that by exfoliating your skin regularly, you will stay younger. You will look younger. So, all right. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Hi, I'm Steve Jan, founder of Ibu Beauty, and these are my sister. We've been together through thick and thin. Nothing comes between us in our family. Just like our bond, the two new releases of the Mooncast collections, our Hero Serum and Hero Moisturizer, are the super duo. Nothing will come between your skin and the Ibu superpowers.